I guess I, I just like I have half a desk right here. I have the this desk. Is the desk. desk. I mean, you're using I, I'm using it. Look at this cup. I have my cup right here on the desk. What's in there? Nothing oh. anymore. My water. I, I'm using something. I'm using it for my controls. Anyway, match up here. Bayonetta versus Peach. Alrighty. Got some Bayo damage coming in. Uh, now, Bayo? Oh, Bayo, Bayo dealing with like Pichu sounds annoying on paper, but like, on, I think like, I feel like the only thing that like would help it a lot better is like the witch time punishes that uh, a Bayo can get and the punish game that Bayo would have. Uh, definitely like character, of course. Uh, but it feels like Bayo has to do a lot more work in this matchup. Uh, yeah, I would agree with you there. Uh, Bayo, we've seen before, um, Bayo did have kind of a hard time killing earlier. But Pichu, not so much. Pichu, Pichu has, uh, has a very good time trying to kill. Has a lot of options at the table. He went for that Nair to... Uh, the jab block. Jab, right, and that, that's a kill option right there. He loves, Juan loves going for that Nair to jab. So... If, if you ever miss an attack for Spawn, you're probably gonna die. He'll, he'll call you, yeah. It looks like he's calling out a lot of, uh... Uh... Oh, Alright, Gel Cup's landing options already with the... With, like, these jump thunder jumps and things. He's calling out a lot of these jumps and these, like, air... These, and these things. Like, these aggressive options that Gel Cup wants to do to get the kill. But Juan is just like, I don't, I'm not gonna die, and you're not gonna kill me. And, yo, and he lived to 190 there. Juan already has my last spell. But, yeah, which, which time being a lot shorter in this game compared to Smash 4, so he was not able to get a whole lot of the top of that. Yeah. Also, heal side's nowhere near the good Mac, as good of a, com a combo starter as it, as it was before. Uh, and up there too. A lot of her, gen her gen all, I, generally speaking, she was like very heavily nerfed. But like, especially her combo tools, the one that she really needed to get those like early ladder kills and things. Wow. Uh, but Joe Cup doesn't, oh, Joe Cup tried. He wanted to get the. He went so deep for it. You could tell he wanted that, that stock. But, uh, Fawn's just gonna turn around and. And just, just like F tilt him yeah. right there at the ledge. He booped him. Alrighty, this is. I was expecting. Yeah, I was, expecting this I was like, right. I was like, please. So I got the Daisy and the Pichu. Uh, Daisy, obviously, a lot better of a character in this game. Uh, she wasn't even existed in Smash 4, so definitely def much better. Definitely much better than Smash 4. Already existing on the character select screen. Biggest buff. Biggest buff ever. Uh, and we got uh, a really like character in the form of Pichu again. Uh, so, I have no idea if Juan has played uh, like Void uh, Daisy or anything. Um, I know Juan, again, like I said, Juan does, uh, tune into the Void streams, and Void does have a Daisy now. Uh, he's been developing one lately, so I have no idea if he's played it or not, but, uh... Juan trying to get something started. Yeah. Oh, I think that might have almost killed him with that bear. He looks like he, he, he looks like he knows what Daisy's gonna want. Uh... The only things I want to see more from Fawn are like the death. Oh! Almost killed that. He slipped out of that bear. Yeah, nah. I want to see the down tilt, uh, like the down tilt, the down air combos or whatever that Pichu has. Uh, they're true on a lot of characters, and especially with Peach from what I've seen. Uh, it can put her in a really bad position at, in, in the corner. Jellico. He got a couple hits going there, but otherwise, it looks like he's been having a very hard time uh, landing anything on his mouth. Oh, okay, there we go. Four, four man. There we go. Uh, even right here. Let's see if he can uh, get something going here in the second stop. 
It doesn't look that that down tilt's setting up for much, or maybe he's just messing up the, the fall, uh, but... I think it's trying to head up, you know? It's like, I just want to at least hit him. Get some percent. Get some percent on him, true. Falling up there, not really going to lead to much. Oh, uh, getting a little cheeky right there. Yeah, Pete, I, I would say Pichu Saki does indeed have zero lag. Uh, and it bounces off, too. So that's very, very hard to punish, to say the least. <laughs> but... Uh, this is interesting. He's keeping it pretty close. Oh, he's keeping it very close now. Uh, I want to see a Nair coming in from freaking uh, Jell Cup, but oh, the up air. This battle for the second stock. Okay, good. He, he, he knew not to punish that there. That's good. Oh, that feature up though. Yeah, that's gonna win the F2 war. Yeah, Thor was just gonna wait for him. Like, hopefully he's gonna move first, and then I'm gonna F tilt him and kill him. Now, as Pichu, it seems like just a viable option right there. Once he once he gets to the the both kill percent part, play your patient game, wait for them to mess up, and then F tilt. Yeah, F tilt is a very. This is a very strong. Yeah, it's a very strong poke and kill option. Oh, can you with the back end of that dash tag, yeah. Barely, like the very, with that. God, the very end of it. Uh, nice aerial movement from Joe Cup, keeping himself safe. But he still has to get the damage on Pichu before he can like, say, uh, before he can like, uh, feel any more comfortable. Ooh. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh, he tried. Oh, oh my god. Okay, that was the scariest interaction ever. No, that's it. No. Oh my goodness. Okay, Fawn takes 2 0, but. I got so high for Austin there. But oh, no, I was getting really high for Austin. Oh my god. Fawn getting him with the Reaper. That is that F tilt. <laughs> it's just like, slice. 